Talk is brought to you by CFU, the power of service. The Panther Wrestling Program heads into the month of February looking pretty strong. Let's talk about some individual guys, and Volker has taken a leap here. Yeah, so. you know, yeah, I'm seeing growth, and you know, we have we have three freshmen in our lineup, uh, three first first year guys that uh, you know, him, Anderson, and Downey. I think they're they're all they're all making jumps right now. Um, you know, he had two wins this this weekend, and he, you can't ever control who steps out there. Uh, you know, thought maybe you're going to wrestle this guy, and they bring a different guy out. Uh, you know, you got you got got wins in both those matches and I, I don't know I've just seen I've seen him continue to improve and get better um, and you know that's what we that's what we want to see each time out uh, you know he lost a little bit of time he, he tweaked he tweaked his hamstring at the at Vegas but coming off that and then coming back to to Nebraska and beating Wyoming kid that was a top 20 kid I just I love the trajectory that he that that you know that he's on and just the, the, that group of freshmen. How about some of the other younger guys in the lineup that are really showing? We got like Sima, you know, I mean, I, I think about that Oklahoma meet, he had a huge pin. Um, another guy that probably, you know, on paper, you know, they're on paper toss up, um, but you know, he goes and gets a pin and really turns a tide for our team and just the energy. And he's had a couple of big pins, but you can see his confidence growing. Um, just how the body language that he has when he steps out there and as he's wrestling a match, um, you know, and that's all you can really ask is that you're gaining momentum and you're getting better throughout the year. And you know, your best wrestling is coming and his is certainly doing that. And Ryder uh, Downey, he's a redshirt freshman out of Indianola. Um, he's a smart one too, valedictorian yeah, 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 of his class, uh, looking to go to med school. Uh, just a, a, a great year so far. Yeah, gritty. I mean, that's gritty tough, like incredibly competitive. And you know, if, when you watch him out there, you're kind of like, man, this guy, like he's kind of, you know, he's kind of goofball, lackadaisical. I mean, sometimes he like, he's like, he's like sitting on the mat or doing, you know, things and, you know, people are like, but it, once you compete with him, I mean, the dude's so competitive. And I, I would say the Oklahoma match, um, he rode the guy out the whole second period. Um, gets an escape, gets a takedown, and like, oh, we got bonus points. And he's like, no, I'm cutting him again. So I'm just saying just kind of, he's got a little bit of edge and competitiveness to him, uh, but he's got an edge and competitiveness to him in the classroom and out of the classroom and any workout that he does. Um, man, just like I said, that, that young group of guys is, I, I don't know, they're keeping it, they're keeping it light for our team. Um, you know, our older guys at Parker's like, man, this is the most fun I've had competing, you know, and it's, yeah. it's because of those guys and I think just the energy they bring and the excitement that they have to go compete, you know, it's like, like let's go see where we're at. Like I said, he's a freshman and, you know, he beat, he beat, you know, a guy who was top, ranked third, um, you know, he's, he keeps beating top 10 guys. The guy he beat at Oklahoma State had, had no losses at 57. Love how he competes, man, and just, you know, how he carries himself, man. <laughs> yeah. And he, and he competes at dodgeball as well. He competes at everything. Yeah, he, he's, I mean, that's him. And, you know, he's got a younger brother on the team. And, yep. you know, his parents, like, he's just been raised really well. Like, like uh, gritty and tough. And, you know, he won a state title, beat a four times. The guy that was going for his four state title, he beat in the state finals. And how he did it, and you're just like, holy cow, man. I just remember kind of people talking about him. Keep telling me, hey, you got to get this kid. And finally we got him. And I'm like, man, I'm so thankful we did. <laughs> Here's that story on Downey. 